Glory be to God in the highest. Hallelujah. Glory be to God in the highest. Hallelujah. Everybody shout hallelujah. 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 Shout and praise God. Hallelujah. 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 This morning I want you to give God praise and glory. Worship the name of the Lord. Give him praise. For this great and awesome opportunity he has given to us. Bless his name. Bless his holy name. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lift up your voices wherever you are. Say to God, I love you, Lord. For your benevolence, for your goodness, for your benefit, I thank you in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. This morning, we are going to read the scripture. As you know, that today is our day five on our fasting of 150 days. Glory to God. As the Holy Spirit has directed us, We're using Psalm 1 to 150. So today is our day 5, Psalms, chapter 5. Book of Psalms, chapter 5. The scripture says, Give Hear to my words, O Lord. Consider my meditation. Hearken unto the voice of my cry, my King and my God. For unto thee will I pray. My voice shall thou hear in the morning, O Lord. In the morning, Will I direct my prayer unto thee and will look up, for thou art not a God that hath pleasure in wickedness, neither shall evil dwell with thee. The foolish shall not stand in thy sight. Thou hated all workers of iniquity. Thou shalt destroy them that speak listen. The Lord will abhor the bloody and deceitful man. But as for me, I will come into thy house in the multitude of thy mercy. And in thy fear will I worship towards thy holy temple. Lead me, O Lord, in thy righteousness. Because of my because of my enemy, make thy way straight before my face. For there is no faithfulness in their mouth. Their inward part is very wickedness. Their throat is an 
open graves. They flatter with their tongue. Destroy thou them, O God. Let them fall by their own counsel. Cast them out in the multitude of their transgression. For they have rebelled against thee. But let all those that put their trust in thee rejoice. Let them ever shout for joy, because thou defendest them. Let them also that love thy name, be joyful in thee. <clears throat> For thou, O Lord, will bless the righteous. <clears throat> with favor, with thou compass him with a shield. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. This morning, I want you to understand the importance of praying in the morning. The scripture says, I will direct my prayer unto thee in the morning. In a particular scripture, the book of Job, the Lord was asking Job and saying, Have you ever commanded the morning? There is what is called the womb of the morning. In the womb of the morning is packaged the goodness, the mercies, the pleasure, the ordination of God's activities in the morning. What you do is to speak from the ordained power of God assigned to you, to every individual that associate himself or to every person who has given himself to God. God assigns you the power to call upon his name. But you have to open up this womb for you to be able to enter into his mercies, into his pleasure, into his unspeakable peace of God. You have to stand in this power to speak and command in the morning. The morning has to do with distributing what we require for the rest of the day. Glory to God. 
So when you are not calling upon the name of the Lord, directing your prayers in the morning, it is dangerous because you may not have the ability to get the substances that is required to live and operate for the day. Glory to God. And the scripture says, the son is, it says, I will direct my prayers in the morning. My voice shall you hear in the morning. Glory to God. And the morning starts by 11.45. Glory to God. I want you to understand what happens in the realm of the spirit. As we are talking in the spiritual realm, Next year, which is 2025, has been set, glory to God. They don't operate on daily basis. But of course, we have to operate on daily basis. However, you need to deep yourself in the spirit to ensure that you follow clearly the voice and the commands of God. When you are following the command of God, the morning will yield its strength to you. You have to associate yourself. You have to be in God. If you are not in God, if you don't have Jesus Christ as your own Lord and personal Savior, if you are not saved by the Lord, <clears throat> If you are not walking in his holy hills, then it will be difficult for you to command the elements that contains in this journey, including the morning. So this morning, I want you to be aware so that you will begin to Check out every wickedness that is associated with your money. Do not keep quiet. The haters of righteousness, the workers of iniquity, should be shaking out of your money. Glory to God. It said, for thou art not a God that has pleasure in wickedness. Every wickedness that is attached to your money becomes a bacteria. Glory to God. You know, when, when a bacteria or a worm is attached, to you. So when you are eating your food, instead of that food having its full effect in your body, they will be attacking that food. They will be taking that food. It becomes a parasite. Wickedness is a parasitic element or substance that drags out or draws out the favor, attacks the favor, the pleasure, the grace of God upon your life, upon the morning. Glory to God. I want you to pray this morning and begin to shake out every wickedness in the name of Jesus Christ. Say, Lord, 
I shake out every wickedness. In my mornings, I shake them out. I shake them out. I shake them out. In the name of Jesus Christ, I shake out every wickedness. Because you take no pleasure in wickedness. Therefore, I shake them out. I shake them out. No wickedness shall rest in my morning. No wickedness shall attach itself in my morning. Yes, Lord. Don't keep quiet. No wickedness shall attach itself in my morning. Yes, my morning shall be dished out with the full capacity of its operation. In the name of Jesus Christ, Zamari Koporo no Chakaya, Zandele Kebo Sokoro Modiaga, Zandele Kukuba Swaba. Yes, Lord, I shake out every wickedness in my mornings. I shake them out. 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 I shake them out in the name of Jesus Christ. Glory to God. The second prayer point. The scripture says, the foolish shall not stand in your sight. Glory to God. We are shaking out every foolishness. No foolishness shall have its dominion over you, nor your children, nor your family. We are shaking out every foolishness in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth this morning. Begin to command that every foolishness will be shaken out of your life, will be shaken out of your morning, will be shaken out of your family, will be shaken out of your children. I shake them out this morning. I want you to shake them out. Every foolishness, I shake them out this morning. It cannot be contained in my morning. I reject and I shake out every foolishness in the name of Jesus. I shake them out. I shake them out. I shake them out. I shake out. out every foolishness out of my children, out of my wife, out of my husband. I shake out every foolishness. I shake it out. I shake it out. I shake it out. I shake it out. I shake it out in the name of Jesus. No foolishness shall rest on your children, on your family, in your siblings, in your husband, in your wife. We shake them out. We shall not be associated with foolishness. Adamari Koporoto, Mande Likoko Bazayata, Robende Kutolo Bozekia, Jandele Kutoko, Ramadi Deto Tahari Makataya. We reject every foolishness. We shake them out. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ, glory to God, we are still shaking them out. Hallelujah. The Bible says in the same verse 5, on the deep part of it, it said, Thou hatest all workers of iniquity. Workers of iniquity. Hallelujah. Workers of iniquity. These people are working. But their job is iniquity. They are workers. Glory to God. They are working. But hey, they are working is iniquity. So the result of their working is iniquity. 
We're going to pray this prayer. Every worker of iniquity that has attached himself, herself, to me, to my children, to my wife, to your husband, to my family, to any of my siblings, every worker of iniquity, we shake them out. Hallelujah. We are shaking them out. Open your mouth. Don't keep quiet. We are shaking out all workers of iniquity that have attached themselves in our lives, in our houses. We shake them out. We destroy them right now. Yes, if the Lord says it is not good, you cannot accept it. Lord is the God. The Lord say it is not good. In the name of Jesus Christ, we shake out every workers of iniquity. Yampa raba to korobo se pranagada. Rima da tele bobo se korobo se kibakasa. We reject every workers of iniquity. We shake them out of our lives. We shake them out. We shake them out. We shake them out. We shake them out. Every workers of iniquity, you are not going to be attached yourself. You are no longer be comfortable in my presence. I reject every worker of iniquity. I cast them out. We shake them out. In the name of Jesus Christ. Zamari Komporuda. Yele Bebe Sokoromo Zakaya. Zendo Lero Om Prenegero Sakuria Malika. Jande le conto corobo sankai. Yes, Lord. Verumaliev. Mandele gavados. Mandele gavados. Mandele gavados. Mandele gavados. Mandele gavados. Mandele gavados. Capari motovaya. Yes, Lord. We shake out every walker of iniquity. We shake them out. I shake them out from my spiritual zone. I shake them out from my offices. I shake them out from our homes. We shake them out. In the name of Jesus. Glory to God. And the scripture continues. To say that thou shalt destroy them that speak Listen, the Lord will abhor the bloody and deceitful man. Bloody, bloody, bloody. Glory to God. Bloody. We want to shake them out of our circle, out of our zone. Bloody men. Those who eat and drink blood. Those who rape children, those who destroy children's innocence, those who kidnap people, those who kill and destroy people. Glory to God. One day, I decided to do a research, and I began to research, and I found out that three miles from where I live, there are child molesters. Glory to God. They're not far from you. They're not far from you. Three miles. It's not far. In fact, I think one of them was 1.5 miles. They're living among us. They are all over. Kidnappers. Child molesters. Killers, criminals of all sorts. I want you to pray. That's why you need to pray. Glory to God. To destroy their powers. To, to, to suck them out of your community. Every bloody man or woman. Those who enjoy killing people. Glory to God. Let the power of God frustrate them right now. Let the power of God destroy them. 
all killers, all destroyers, all thieves. The power of God will frustrate their powers, will frustrate their activities. They will no longer be active, operating around your zone in the name of Jesus Christ. That's, that's why we pray. The Bible calls them bloody and deceitful men, bloody and deceitful woman. Open your mouth. Decree this morning. I dissolve, I shake them out, every bloody and deceitful man and women, in the name of Jesus Christ, I shake them out of our zone, I shake them out, I shake them out, those who kidnap, I shake them out, those who destroy light, I shake them out, oh my kimba raba do korobo sekerebo, rema no kotolo breke telibobos, rema bendorobo do siabada, rambe de gedeli brege de libodo, le brege de libodo do brege de liba, le brege de libodo do brege de liba, we shake them out, we shake them out, we shake them out, we shake them out, the Bloody man and the sinful man. The bloody man and the sinful man. We shake them out in the name of Jesus. We shake them out. We dissolve their activity. They will no longer be active. More Sakaya. Yes, they will go to where they belong to. Glory to God. Yes, they can no longer operate. Even this day, let this morning be a judgment in their lives, wherever they are right now. Bloody man, bloody man, deceitful man. Yes, Lord, we release the sword of divine justice this morning. Assemble rumenete, assemble rumenete, ashalukoporo, batroboye, batroboye, zakoriebe tokoli bramaya, in the name of Jesus Christ. Glory to God. Yes, so the Himakasa. Bande legebedos. Bande legebedos. Bande legebedos. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Very much sangiado. Hallelujah. Verse 9, the scripture says, For there is no faithfulness in their mouth. Their inward part is very wickedness. Their throat is an open grave. They flatter with their tongue. Glory to God. Every flatterer, those who flatter, those who have made their throat become an open grave. You know what that means? When they open their throat, they are eating human beings. You may be shocked that people eat human beings. Glory to God. And they are not far from you. Glory to Jesus. Yes, I want you to pray this morning. Anyone whose throat is an open grave, we close that grave from today. We cover that grave with the dust of heaven. With the dust of heaven. We cover the grave. Yes, Lord. With the dust and stones of heaven. We cover every grave. Those who have made their throats as graves, we cover them. We cover that throat. We cover that throat with the dust of heaven. Today is your last day. You can no longer eat or sacrifice humans. In the name of Jesus Christ, we cover that throat. We roll the stones of heaven. We cover them right now. We cover them. No more shall you operate. In the name of Jesus Christ, glory to God. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory. 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 
The scripture says, let those that put their trust in thee, in thee, O Lord, let them ever shout for joy because you will defend them. Glory to God. There is a joy coming to you this morning. There is a favor. He said, with favor will you compass him with a shield. A shield and a favor is upon you this morning. In the name of Jesus Christ, begin to glorify God. Say, Lord, I thank you for your favor. I thank you for your joy. I thank you for your protection upon my life this morning. As the scripture has said, yes, Lord, as the scripture has said, we are covered under you. In the name of Jesus Christ, I give you glory. 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 In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Raise your hand. Raise your hand wherever you are. If you are sick, there is a healing virtue, healing power of God that is proceeding right now. Hallelujah. For where I am, the Lord said, I will visit you wherever you are this morning. I'm going to touch you, touch you and heal you. As long as you're hearing my voice right now, there's a healing for you. Raise your hand if you're sick. Father, in the name of Jesus, I decree healing. If you have anyone sick in the house, the power of God is going to help, is going to heal the person right now. In the name of Jesus, any condition that you are facing that is attacking your body, your body system, your internal organ, whichever part of your body that is under siege or under attack, I release the power of healing. I release the healing power of God right now from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet, to touch every inward part of your body. In the name of Jesus Christ, every system in your body, let them receive healing now. In the name of Jesus Christ, be healed in Jesus' name. Be healed in Jesus' name. Be healed in Jesus' name. Amen. I want you to still put your right hand on your head as we decree for your protection. I cover you with the blood of Jesus Christ. I cover your children. No accidents. No thief breaking your houses. No one taking over your properties. I cover you with the blood of Jesus Christ. Every debt upon you. Every debt. D-E-B-T. I command that the power of God we remove that death from your head. In the name of Jesus Christ, yes, let the miracle power of God, the miraculous power of God, touch you, that pays death, hallelujah, that provides abundance, even touch you this morning, including the protection of God. In the name of Jesus Christ, thank you, Father, for hearing us. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Amen.